And it underscores the point that we say it all the time, the best ability is availability. Hmm. And you pull a stunt like this, you get thrown out, you get suspended, you're not available, and it hurts one thing, and that's your team, Tim. It does. I mean, really, to me, this entire thing was selfishness. I, mean, this, I, I know that if you're not concerned enough, you think about this, for Keep to Leave, he's going to lose about a million dollars. He's made a lot of money. He hasn't made enough money to not care about losing a million dollars. Michael Crabtree. Over going to start hitting your bottom line, and you better start rethinking your behavior, Pat. Well, I mean, to your point, though, it's hit their bottom line in a different capacity in the sense that they lose money by missing games. Right, but I, I mean, bigger I, picture. Yeah, I agree. I mean, the league, I mean, you know what I'm getting at here. The bigger yeah. picture, the league is trying to, like, say, hey, look, we got to clean some of this they, up. They probably should have sent a message a little sooner, but regardless, just mm -hmm. Well, I just want to say a couple of things. One, I addressed that with the discipline, but I don't think this is a large-scale issue with regards True. to fighting. Even, you know what, if, if, it's, if there's one incident or if there was 10. The, the, the fact of the matter, though, is, Josina, mm -hmm. the environment is different right now. They act, then the league can't just sit there and go, well, I'm going to handle this the same way I did the A.J. Green situation, because quite honestly, it's not. It's not the same situation. It's not the same guys with the same history. And, and if you don't stop that... Day, those appeals are being heard today, and they hope to have an expedited ruling, quite possibly tonight. And to Adam's point, these teams do need to know who will be available on Sunday. That will be week 13. Good job. That was Thank you. an outstanding well piece. Mm -hmm. You know, what, what made him so unique? What made him different than what we see today? You know, you know now people... And so so I, I say that simply because for you to say he's the most talented player you ever scouted is yeah. saying something. Yeah. Why was that the case? And I made sure I communicated that to him when he got there that, you know what, I'm on all the disappointment I had in my own career about not reaching maybe the heights I wanted to. I said, you know what? I'm going to live them through you because I think you're going to be one of the greatest ever. Lean, just a thoroughbred. And you, it was nothing he couldn't do. Him being snatched away from the National Football League, from society in general, is one of the biggest travesties I could ever imagine happening in the world of sports. He was that different. It was surreal when the call came that preseason game. My last conversation in person was the preseason game that year. And he was telling me, he was talking about baby Jackie, and he was talking about Jackie, and he was talking about being saved. And he was telling once all of that got quiet, we were finally getting to see who he was as a man and who he was going to be as a player. And Lewis is right. I played with some of the best to ever do it at any position. He could can't top that. Yeah. So uh, job well done by you, Ryan, and mm -hmm. certainly Sean Taylor gone far too soon. Uh, when it comes to fashion,